Hello fans of the Fishing Musicians YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video. I know it's a little dark, but it's also very early in the morning. Well, not too, too early, but it's around uh, quarter to six and it is uh, mid-September. Salmon season is on. I've been up for a while, so I'm figuring I'm gonna go for a drive to Middle Landing again to find that elusive Atlantic salmon I've been hunting and trying to find. So I'm on my way up there. We're gonna have a little shore coffee, take a few casts, and just enjoy the morning and the sun up on the river and see what it looks like. So we'll see you on the road, gang. So I'm just get. I'm not gonna bring my vest because we don't have to get it in the water, and it's just a quick walk. So I don't know how this video is gonna turn out, folks. But this is just kind of what we do. Uh, you can't see much. This is how dark it is. We're just on the side of what we call Kianacon Road. The bridge is right here at Middle Landing. The reason why I come up here is easy access, and it's the place I caught my first salmon. So anyway, we're gonna pick out a couple of assorted flies and then head up the Mi'kmaq Trail to our regular fishing spot. Uh, I know you can't see anything here. So we're hitting the trail. It's pretty early at sunup, it's only in about an hour. Access E, Mi'kmaq Trail. Um, yeah, that's a bit of a sketchy walk on the road. I didn't think there'd be any traffic at this time of the morning, but a lot of logging trucks and stuff. So, anyhow, let's hope we don't meet any critters on the trail here. I'll let you know when we make out. Definitely going to be first on the pool. I'm only going to stay here for a few casts. We'll see how this works out. So, yeah. Climbing in the dark to the fishing spot. It's only three degrees right now. You have to be really careful here. Definitely harder, especially when you're holding the camera. I'm trying to, I gotta hold on with one hand here. No bear. Made it up there. You can see the river. Be really careful here. Go, go. Yeah. We usually walk through the dense forest, full of animals, by yourself. No bear. No bear. Here, bear. What I'm saying? No bear. I definitely do not want to run into any animals here. I can get to the fast part of the river. Must be very careful. What is that? I just heard something in the water. I don't know what the hell that is. I can't even see the river yet. The sun's coming up. Freaky. Not quite the same when you're walking here alone in the dark. Can't really see anything yet. That is the river. Right there. Oh, it's dark. Anyway, I'm going to have to wait a bit to cast a line because it's not legally uh, time. And secondly, I can't see shit. And this is where it gets sketchy. So we're just getting a wee fire going before we take a cast. I got a fish on, hard to do with a phone. 
But I got a salmon that jumped out of the water already three times. Looks like a grills. I'll let you know. I got a salmon on, folks. It's hard to film and try to bring it in here. It's a good sized fish. I've been fighting it for about five minutes. So gang, as you saw, I had a fish on and then I put my camera on a rock to record and I didn't hit record. It was hard to uh, fight that fish and bring it in. I brought up the camera, showed the camera, was all excited and noticed I didn't hit record. That really sucks. Anyway, it was close to 10 pounds for sure, second cast. So uh, definitely a fulfilling uh, morning already. And uh, yeah, so I used a, a muddler minnow with some extra yellow and red tail on it that uh, Jackie Burke from his uh, fly shop downtown Bathurst tied. Thanks, Jackie. And uh, that's certainly made my morning. So I'm going to try a few more casts. I didn't plan on staying here very long. Definitely awesome. Uh, so the quest is done. I wish someone else was here to hold the camera, but it's really the fight in Atlantic Salmon. It jumped out of the water about eight times. It was wild. So I was pretty... Uh, freaked out and shaking and all that stuff so anyway thank you Nipizzeret River thank you Salmon and it went back released it safe and it had lots of life in it strong fish it really sucks that I didn't hit record on the camera and I've got my other big camera here too but I just I wasn't even ready for that fish like I said it was second cast and it was kind of not even a real cast Anyhow, that's the way it goes, and I'm feeling very fortunate that I did hook that. So I'm only going to take a few more casts because I've got to go back to work. I just came for a drive. But this is what uh, I'm looking at right now. Thank you, Middle Landing. This is the place I hooked my first fish over there on the other side, right there. So I know that wasn't much of a video, guys. Uh, Especially that I didn't hit record when I set up the camera. I didn't even have my little tripod for the phone. I didn't expect to film anything, really. Uh, I didn't expect, no, sorry. I expected to film something. I didn't expect to catch anything. Second cast, awesome. Anyway, I gotta go back to work. So it's still early. As you can see, the leaves are changing. Absolutely beautiful. So I'm on my way back. Thanks for watching the Fishing Musicians YouTube channel. There'll be more shows. And hopefully I have another buddy here. We can bring the cameras and uh, do a proper job with uh, hooking and releasing one. I'm really bummed that uh, the camera wasn't recording because I brought the fish right up to the camera. did a big talk. Uh, that was a beautiful, strong fish too male had the kipe on it. it means its bottom part of its mouth was turning upwards it was a little darker but it totally had tons of strength and it took a lot of my line as well and then my drag was screwing up so i haven't really hooked anything big with this rod in quite some time but it held up really well and my leader hooked up properly this time so that's all good 
So anyway, gang, we'll continue the uh, salmon fishing adventures on the, the Pisiquit River. Uh, as we continue to fish, we still have another four weeks or so, because it ends on the 22nd of uh, October. So the water's starting to get real cold. And to me, my best luck has always been first thing in the morning. It's pretty wild. I was really excited when I hooked that one. It, it went after twice, actually, from what I could think. I can't think right now. I'm still excited. Anyhow, thanks for watching, guys. Better pay attention or I'm going to lose an eye here. Cheers. Take it easy. I drive back, there's two moose. You guys better go hide, man. It's moose season, and we just heard a gunshot at the river. Not them, obviously. Wow. <laughs>